Right, so, I got you. Then so he then he was then he was still heavy. And you know, just like what I said, I was a lightweight man. Mm. Just you know, he was a natural welterweight. Yeah. And so oh, so that then you know, even with that fight, man, it's it was a lot going on in that camp, even with the money issue. Mm. And man, you know, you know, there's a lot of fighters, man, got robbed. A lot of fighters don't get paid what they supposed to get paid. Mm. And then, you know, even even just like what I said, like even even what I said before, he was my trainer, mm. promoter, mm. whatever you want to call it. Yeah. And even when they brought the amount to me, the contract, they said, this is how much you fought fighting for them. Even by me looking at it, I said, nah, man, this ain't yeah. right, man. So mm-hmm. I said, you got to go and get more money. Yeah. Because it was for a world title. Mm. Moving up in weight. Mm. And it was it it was it was a lot of drama going on and this and that. I was like, man, y'all need to y'all need to get some more money, man, because I'm not fighting for this amount. Yeah. Uh, you know what I'm saying? And you know, I'm you know, I'm one of them guys that was at the top, you know, fighting for world titles, fighting, yeah. you know, you know, some good fighters and didn't yeah. really make the money that I supposed to make because mm. because of bad management. The the people that I had behind me, I thought they had had my back, but at the same time, it was looking out for themselves. And, mm-hmm. and you know, even, you know, the amount that I made for a Timothy Bradley fight. Yeah. When they brought the the contract, it was 32000 I was like, what? That's why oh. I said, 30, oh, yeah, 32000 No, 32, no, man. 32000 No, 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 no. Yeah. <laughs> no. So, yeah. Hey, no. man, we got a lot to hey. Hey, we got man. Hey, take your time. You. Take your time. We we yeah. we here. We here. <laughs> we here. Yeah. So, fighting for fighting for a title for the yeah. WBC, which, mm. which I'm which I'm which I'm the challenger. You know what I'm saying I'm I'm fighting Timothy Bradley for his for his title. Yeah. For defense, and they brought that. Hey, we want the sort of. Well, I said, nah, man. Something wasn't right. Something wasn't right about that when they brought 30, 32. Thirty-two thousand was thirty some thirty-two thousand dollars to me. I said, "Nah, man." I said, "Y'all Absolutely. need to go back." Then they said, "Nah, if you if you don't if you don't, you know, what I'm saying we don't yeah. lose the fight. This and that and this and that." Yeah. Then so they so whoever it was, so I think at that time it was it was he was with Bob Aaron. If I'm not like if I'm not mistaken, you know what I'm saying. Mm. But then so you know you know I, you know at the same time I'm getting ready for the fight and this and that and, and you know. And then even uh, my wife had told me at that time, don't take it or this and mm. that. But, you know, at the same time I'm looking at, man, I will take care of my family. I, I got a wife and kids and this and that. Then, you know, to me, like, there's something like, it still sounds good. But at the same time, I'm asking for more, you know? Yeah. So they went to talk to the whoever. Mm. But just remember, they're the, they're, the, they're the manager, they're the promoter. They know probably, just like I said, they ready to give them some money up front, whatever. I know for world title that don't that don't sound right. Mm. I, that don't sound right for thirty. Don't sound right at all. Then finally he got it to thirty six. <laughs> thirty six thousand, right? Oh man, please. Thirty six thousand for, for a world title for oh, WBC, please. and it's on and it's on Showtime, right? Oh Showtime. my, oh my, yeah. gosh, yeah, Showtime, Showtime, and we was now just remember we was the co-main co-main mm. event. Mm. Cold made it for thirty, so they so they brought up the thirty six thousand, mm. and so that was you know that was that fight, and you know, you know camp, you know for me camp went well. I trained well, man, and you know, you know for that fight, I mean I ate good, and you know for that for that fight, I left home, man. I left my wife, I left my kids, mm. and. and then you know, I so I went and stayed in Tampa, man, just where I could stay focused, where I yeah. could stay, you know, get ready for this fight because this is a big fight for me, and you know, it's a big and, one. You know, I, I did everything, and you know, then you know, kept one well. Then you you know, we went over there and and, and weigh in and this and that, but and he still and he still didn't make weight. Mm. And he had to go run, ha. run it off. Well, that's so, good so for you. He went to run it off. Then yeah, then, you know he. So he finally made it. So, okay. so he made so, so the fight was on, right? So the fight All was right. on, man. The 
if I was on then, man, and you know, the the bad thing that really hurt me again in that fight, man, because we was the co main and the main event, probably like, you know, Nate Nate Campbell. Mm. You know, the Galaxy Warrior, Nate Campbell. Nate Campbell was the main event for that fight. Mm. But him and him and Juan Guzman supposed to fight the main event. But that fight didn't went through because because um of Guzman. I, yeah, Guzman did not make weight. Okay. So the so fight was off. Off. So now you're the main off. event. Now you're the main event. Yeah, so now, so now we become the main event. Yeah. Man, so money wasn't, so they, the money didn't even change. It, I fought oh. for the same amount. Oh, my God. Same amount. Same amount, man. Mm. And, you know, mm. so, you know, just like I said, man, I'm one of them fighters, man, that went, that went through it, man. That mm. didn't get paid, man. And and you mm. know, and and I fought the, you know, I fought Timothy Bradley. He's a pretty good fighter, man. You know, yeah. You know, as a lightweight, and uh, you know, fighting him, he's not a he's not a hard hitter, man. But he stayed busy, man. He stayed uh, busy. Yeah. Timothy Bradley, he's a he stayed busy. He mm. worked, and. And you know, um, I fell short. You know what I'm saying? I fell short in that fight. We we went all the way 12 round. And you know, he he knocked me down, I think in the sixth round, somewhere around now. Yeah. And you know, he won, then he won by by a unanimous decision. And so, you know, that was a mistake that we, you know, happened right. and we did. And then, you know, money mm. wasn't right. Mm. And mm. then then after that, then you know, I had to pay my 10% <laughs> to my to my trainer. It was just remember now, he was the manager. I mean, mm. I, I, I don't know, like a like you know, I I just I just put the manager part, but he was my promoter and my yeah. trainer. Yeah. So mm. I was double dipping. Mm. Right. Mm. So, mm. so yeah, man, and you know, that was my last that was my last fight with him. Um, um, after after that fight, matter of fact, matter of fact, we was we like we had another fight after that with with like we was we was we was gonna have another fight, yeah, with him. Then I find out, I find out that they was taking money from me. The the reason why how I, how I find out uh, was um after the Timothy Bradley fight. Because uh, I know my wife, my wife was telling me, "Hey, Eddie, yeah. Eddie, we need yeah. something ain't right." Then I was like, "Nah, babe, you know, you know." Women you always know. know. Women always know when a man's getting yeah, rough. Yeah. I'm telling you. I'm yeah. telling you. I'm yeah, telling man. you. Yeah. So you know, and then when when I really found my wife had been telling me, my she was been telling me that I was like, "Nah, babe, nah, nah, nah," but. You know, since I've been with him for eight years, man, then I really, really find out for a fact, mm. and it was true. Then I had proof, and um, then after the Timothy Bradley fight, we signed a contract to, to fight at the at the Madison Square Garden in uh, New York. Um, I I didn't suppose to fight um uh, Anthony uh Anthony Peterson, Lamont brother, Anthony yeah, Lamont yeah. brother, yeah, we signed a contract. Everything. Contract was signed. I sent it off, and we was a week out for the fight. We was a week out, and I thank God that 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 fight did not happen. And that that week, uh, when I came in to the gym, and we was we was uh, doing our last work, you know, gonna you know just take you know tape it down, just do a little bit work. Then when yeah. I came back to the gym that that Monday, that that last week, then uh, he, they, so he said, "Well, Edna, the the fight is off." Because uh, Anthony Peterson hurt, hurt his uh, hurt his ankle. He twisted his ankle uh, when he was running. So uh, so a guy I usually keep keep in contact with. He he used to work for Boxing Talk. So so I so I call him up. I say, Hey man, the fight is off. So he asks me, How much you supposed to fight for that fight? So I so I so I told him. I said, mm. Well, I supposed to fight fight Anthony Peterson for forty thousand, right? Yeah, for forty thousand. Yeah, and then so he said, "Hold on, Edna. Let me give you a call. Then I'll call you back." Then he said, "Well, I'm gonna go to call the promoter of that show." With I think at that time the promoter was Fight Prize mm -hmm. and Fight Prize, and so he so he called the promoter and and asked him how much Edna's supposed to fight for. He called me back. He said, "Well, Edna, 
they lied to you. He said, but the, now just remember, I signed the contract, right? Mm. For twenty thousand dollars. Oh Lord! I signed a contract for twenty thousand, twenty thousand, and then when he called me back, he said, "Edna, um, you supposed to make forty thousand for that fight." Oh Lord! I was like, "What?" I was like, "Forty?" He said, "Yeah." He said, "I just talked to the promoter. He said no. you supposed to make forty thousand for that fight." So right there, they took half of that, right? Half. Mm. I mean, with me knowing, like they just made a contract for twenty. And then, and it's man, it's it's so crazy, man. Even when you was, was gonna have to all, pay him more, he was gonna have to pay him some more. He was gonna have to pay him another ten or twenty percent on top of that. He was gonna skim you some more. Yeah, 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 yeah. Then after that, then I would have paid him my ten, my ten percent off of that twenty. And then like, then like what? Then what? Like kind of um, hurt me again. Like mm. even like when I look back, that all the fights I had. Mm. And, you know, all the fights I had, mm. and even with Ricky Keyless, and even with, uh, no, no, not with, Keyless, with Ricky Keyless, Pauly Monaghi. Mm. Mm. Man, it's, then, you know, as, you know, we, we, did, we fought as, you know, as the, I think we was the main event, Coleman or main event, yeah. that I fight in New York. I, I think the main event. Against Pauly Monaghi. Uh, yeah, yeah Pauly mm. Monaghi, just to, just remember, uh, Paul, remember Paulie had fought Cotto? Yeah. Then, so that was his next fight. I was his next fight coming up, you know, from his, from his injury and mm. this and that. Because you just remember Cotto beat him real bad. Yes, yes, Cotto yes. Cotto beat yes. Paul de Monarchy real bad. Then I was his next fight. So, you know, I moved up in weight to fight Paulie Monarchy. And, you know, what's, what's, what's so crazy? How can I make more money? Right, mm. Polly Monarchy than Timothy Bradley. I made forty. I made forty for um. Uh, Malinaji. Uh, Malinaji. Malinaji. Yeah. Yeah. Then I made thirty six for um uh, Bradley. Timothy Bradley. Then you know Polly. Polly fight was a non-title fight. A non-title fight, right? But, yeah. And that's what's so crazy, man. And it's man, I been robbed my whole career, and my whole career when I was with. With this uh, uh trainer for eight years, man. I never made nothing, man. I was like, man, and you know, they, they don't, you know, I'm here try to you know, try to provide for my family, for my wife and kids. And you know, at the same time, man, I'm being robbed, man. And you know, I never bring I never bring enough of money, you uh, know, you know, to take care of my family. You know, by the time I by the time I bring the check home, by the time I uh, pay everybody their 10% that who helped. And then after that, then I got paid the taxes off of that. And I never made nothing, man. Being honest, as a fighter, man, then I seen people that I grew up with, that I came up with in the gym that I know become world champion. They made the money. Then I, you know, then I look at myself, man. I said, like, man, why me, man? Why I'm not making the money, man? Why I haven't made what I need to make? And you know, mm. I've been rocked my whole career, man. Then, you know, finally, man. So I, so I left him, man. So I left him. Who was that? Who, 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 who was the? Who were those people? Who were those people? Uh, uh, my trainer, my uh, Peter Fernandez, the the one with my promoter, whatever. Yeah. So, so, so I was, so I left him, man. So I left okay. him. Yeah. And so I went with another trainer, man.